Cavity quantum electrodynamics cavity QED is the study of the interaction between light confined in a reflective cavity and atoms or other particles, under conditions where the quantum nature of light photons is significant. It could in principle be used to construct a quantum computer. The case of a single two-level atom in the cavity is mathematically described by the Jaynes Cummings model, and undergoes vacuum Rabi oscillations. E N minus one left right arrow G N display style E wrangle N one wrangle left right arrow G wrangle N wrangle that is between an excited atom and N one photons and a ground state atom and N photons. If the cavity is in resonance with the atomic transition, a half cycle of oscillation starting with no photons coherently swaps the atom qubit's state onto the cavity fields. Alpha G plus beta E zero left right arrow G alpha zero plus Beta one display style alpha g wrangle plus beta e wrangle zero wrangle left right arrow g wrangle alpha zero wrangle plus beta one wrangle and can be repeated to swap it back again. This could be used as a single photon source, starting with an excited atom, or as an interface between an atom or trapped ion quantum computer and optical quantum communication. Other interaction durations create entanglement between the atom and cavity field, for example, a quarter cycle on resonance starting from E 0 gives the maximally entangled state a Bell state E 0 plus G 1 2 Display style E wrangle zero wrangle plus G wrangle one wrangle SQRT two. This can in principle be used as a quantum computer, mathematically equivalent to a trapped ion quantum computer with cavity photons replacing phonons. Topic Nobel Prize in Physics. The 2012 Nobel Prize for Physics was awarded to Serge Hiroche and David Weinland for their work on controlling quantum systems. Hiroche was born 1944 in Casablanca, Morocco, and in 1971 gained a PhD from Université Pierre et Marie Curie in Paris. He shares half of the prize for developing a new field called cavity quantum electrodynamics CQED, whereby the properties of an atom are controlled by placing it in an optical or microwave cavity. Hirosh focused on microwave experiments and turned the technique on its head, using CQED to control the properties of individual photons. In a series of groundbreaking experiments, Hiroshi used CQED to realize Schrödinger's famous CAD experiment in which a system is in a superposition of two very different quantum states until a measurement is made on the system. Such states are extremely fragile, and the techniques developed to create and measure CQED states are now being applied to the development of quantum computers. <laughs> 